Hey guys, my name is Cityac and welcome to Cities in Motion 2. This is the prequel, if that's what you would pull it, to City Skylines. The developers of City Skylines, this is what the last game they made in terms of city building before the City Skylines. And I thought it would be quite fun to try and build a city in this. Now this game, I believe, came out in 2013, so it is many, 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 many moons old. I think it came out. It says on Steam it was 2013. And I'm going to be honest with you right now, I've seen nothing of this game. I don't know how to play this game. I don't know what this game entails right now. I think it just is based on public transport and you grow the city via public transport, I believe. Uh, so if that's the case, guys, I might potentially turn this into a series. So if you do enjoy this and want to see more of this, as I do try to build my very own city, then smash that like button down below. If you're new around here, make sure you do subscribe so you get notified next time this come out. Now, if there is a tutorial, I'm ignoring it. Okay, it says tutorial city, but again, I'm ignoring it. I am going to go in this game completely blind. So if you've played this game before, get ready to be triggered. If you haven't played this game before, you're going to learn just like how I'm going to learn right now. So there's actually quite a lot of good maps right there. I think I might just start with Central City because it looks like we can create some really good public transport networks. Now, disable city growth, random objectives. I'm going to leave all this as it is. I ain't going to mess around with it. Uh, difficulty level, we'll put it on, keep it on normal. Custom rules, I mean, nothing I can really change there. And we're going to start. How much is this going to be like City Skylines? I don't know. It would be nice to see how City Skylines evolved from this game. What they brought over from this game to City Skylines. That's what's going to be fun for me to kind of find out. That's going to be the fun part all about it right now. Now, we're just waiting for the uh, the game to all load up, and we're going to begin. So, let's, like I said, guys, if you want to see more of this, smash the like button down below. Uh, if you're in here, subscribe so you get notified next time it does come out. This is probably the world's best loading screen. Oh! Hello. Hello. So, right, before anything happens, I'm going to put the game into pause mode so I can kind of get my bearings. Um, wait, hold on. This is not the map I selected. Maybe they're forcing me to do the tutorial. I think they are. Okay, we're gonna learn then. I was hoping to go into it completely blind, but it looks like we're going to learn. So, right, first things first. Can I make the UI slightly bigger? Probably not. Miscellaneous. No, that's fine. This is how it all is. Good to go. So anyway, um, I've got 18 missions, I think, to kind of do right now. Now, that doesn't seem too hard. I'm sure when we get done in no time. First, you should minimize. So I've got to learn to zoom in and out. Uh, I can zoom in out with the keys. I can also tilt and rotate. Uh, got you, got you, got you. This is the city right now. I mean, if you didn't know, it looks like i got a texture pack on City Skylines right now, doesn't it? Right, next. So, um, right, so there's a lot more to a city than uh, what you can see on the street level. To really get to know who is going where and what destinations are most popular, you can use the map data tab. You'll find this tab under the drawer icon thingy. The, the drawer, oh, down here. So this is what this game is pretty much all about, is trying to get people transported. And we can learn about the buildings, and you can see uh, who wants to go where. So we're going to look at, uh, oh, so you can see workplaces are red, homes are green, which is mainly up here. Yellow is home slash workplaces. Pink is workplace slash leisure. Blue is leisure. Right, blue color. So we can see then that the blue color peeps are looking to go from their homes here to working over here. Oh, okay. Um, okay, so blue color of the map. By applying this feature, you can see homes, places, work, leisure, other places. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Well done. Now, the next step is to have a look at the tools you have at your disposal. To build a thriving transport system, you will need many different vehicle types. Go to build panel and see what's available. Right, okay, so the first look at what we can potentially build. So we can build a um, oh, construct structures for buses, trolleys, trams, metros, and even water buses. Interesting. Right, next. Uh, click, choose the bus tools. Can we find the construction menu by something? That, um, okay, so select bus, and then what do we need to kind of select? So build a bus line. Start by building a depot and placing stops. So do I go with like a small depot, a basic bus depot? Now where do I place it? 
This is all the decisions your boys now gotta make. You know what? The infrastructure looks really good. I'm not even gonna lie. Um, oh, I like how it goes under the bridge there. That's pretty cool too. Right, where do I put the, the bus thing here? Should I just put it here? Right, I put my bus depot just there. So, build the bus line. Now start by placing the stops. So, I'm now going to build the bus stops. So, in what I can see then, it would make more sense to... Right, which way is that? That one comes in. How do they get out? They go out that way. It makes more sense to place a stop down here than bring them in hot and heavy... I mean, where, where do I put them now? One there. This is the thing. I don't know the logistics behind this. But I feel like I'm placing a bunch of bus stops right now. There we go. Um, keep in mind that your line must start and end at the depot. So place six stops. Do I have to actually like place the, the actual like line itself? That's the next question that I kind of want to find out. So, right, we've done that. So, open the transportation panel. To, oh, create a new bus line. Right, okay. Okay. So, I'm only really picking people up from here, which is hilarious. <laughs> but this is all part of learning. Create a new bus line. So, we need to then select these stops. So, add a stop, which I am assuming we're going to have to then click here. No? Okay. Add stop. Oh, there. To here. No? There's not that not how I do it. So line must start at the depot. So click to add the first line. Boom. And then do I click here for the next line? Yes. We have to do a little bit of an awkward U-turn. Oh, this is just like playing the city skylines. And then we're gonna make them come all the way over to here. So then go down to here, to here, to here, to here, and then back again, right? That's my bus route. I mean, make of that as you will. Judge it as you will. Uh, but there's a couple of stops there. Not bad. Um, I'm not in play mode yet, so we can't see the buses coming out. Uh, okay, that's all done. So next, click your bus depot and buy free buses. Oh, you actually, actually have to buy the buses right now? Okay. So, buy vehicles. Ooh, this is interesting. Okay. So, do I have the free ability to buy what any bus I want? Um, purchase price. How much money have I got? I just realized this. Does it tell us anywhere? Oh, okay. We got uh, 99,000. So this one, maintenance required. Okay, right. Small 10 seats versus 20 seats versus 30 seats. I might go for the middle one if that's okay. No, let's go for the big boy. And I want to buy three of these. So purchase free buses. Nice. Let me put it into play mode then. Do we actually now see it all in action? Let's get rid of you. Get rid of you. Oh my goodness me, a bus is actually coming out and hitting those mean streets. There it goes. I'm going to be transporting people. And my bus stop is just over here as well. So... Do we see people walking around? I don't know how advanced this game is. No idea. Right, next. Uh, looks like your line could do with a longer breaks between vehicles. Go to the transport panel. Uh, and open the bus line by clicking on it and press the little clock icon. Okay. So here we go. So what do I do? Interval and how much do I want to increase it by? So once you have the line go and take a look at how uh, the vehicles tend to be, if they're empty. Ah, okay. So interval. Oh, this changes this. I don't quite get it. Is that good enough? <laughs> I don't know. 230. Is that, is that good enough? Um, you should, I should dispatch more. Do I have to keep increasing this? 4? I don't know what I've done there. <laughs> I don't know what I've done. So is the interval a bus comes every 4 minutes or the next one dispatches after 4 minutes? Is that how it works? Who knows? Is anybody getting on board? No one's really waiting at this bus stop right now. This is probably not the, the best bus stop ever. There's zero numbers everywhere right now. Uh, okay. 
uh, you may sometimes find yourself in a situation where there are no good way to arrange a route. If you get stuck like this, here's a little trick. Build a new road. Oh, okay, okay. So, build a new road. Now, where where do I build said road? Um, okay, okay, we can pick different types of roads right now. Do I have the ability to build a road? Should I build a road? Um, I don't quite know what they want me to do about this one. Oh, hold on! There's vehicles appearing out of left, right, and center. This is actually pretty cool. Right, can I build a road? Right, I built a road. I'm not quite sure what to do now. <laughs> but I built a road, guys. I built a road. Very well done. Now, trams are a bit different from buses. They need tracks to run on. Why don't you try your hand at building a line for them? Okay. Okay, one second then. So now we're starting to see movement within the city. Does this mean that we will eventually... I should have put like a bus route going through here. Um, does this mean we'll then start to see people getting and waiting at the bus stops, maybe? I think this is the world's worst bus stop, isn't it? I tried to do the blue collar route, obviously. I should have done the global city route, is what I should have done. Oh, wait, hold on. There's people actually waiting at the bus depot. Ah. Well, anyway, I'm getting too carried away. So over here, the tram track. So I can build a tram track, and then what am I meant to do? Where do I upgrade? What happens now? Oh, is that how you do it? Just simply drop in. So there's nothing here. I can extend it this way. So if I do like a full distance, or oh, you can kind of split it as well. Keep it in the middle, maybe. I've gone the full distance with trams. I don't know how I feel about that, but continue anyway. So, when your tracks are built, uh, you can add stops and depots, just like uh, the bus line. Okay, so down here, uh, is this the tram? Tram structures. Now, we'll build a depot first, a nice small-ish depot. Now, I'm going to assume that this, I mean, it could pretty much go on anywhere. So, if I placed it just there, which means destroying a building... And if I quickly uh, upgrade... Let me do a loop here. I can see us having to do a loop. There we go. There we go, boys. Coming up... What's happened here? Can I destroy something? I don't quite know if I can destroy. Or how I even... Get a connection like this. So we can't build a tram around this connection? Right, I think I'm getting too carried away. Right, add a stop. So I can add a stop. Let's just say I added a stop there. Then added a stop there there right that's probably as much as you want to do then maybe go the opposite way double stoppage on the trams uh, okay I've done double stoppage uh, you can find the tram location be mindful that to watch your tracks place them each stop so your trams can reach it try avoiding eight try adding eight stops okay Right, so that's eight stops, and now they're going to want me to connect these stops. But my line's not even ready for this. It really is not ready for this. So, create a new one. Add a stop, which has got to start at the depot. We've learned that. Comes out, and it can't come out to there, because I've got to do something to get this all set up. So, bulldoze. Okay, can't bulldoze that road. How do I delete, like, a... A section. Oh, hold on. I think I've just figured it out. Right, so... You go there. Right, why can't they connect? Aha! Ha ha! Right, I've just figured it out. 
Okay, I figured it out, guys. So you've got to pick between the two. Okay, maybe it doesn't work like that. <laughs> maybe it doesn't work the way I'm thinking it works. No? I don't think it works the way I'm thinking it works. Right, that goes that way. But I kind of... Yeah, that goes that way to go into... This is all really weird, isn't it? This has all gone really weird. Right. Delete that. So then re-edit it back on. I think I know what I'm doing there. So I want that to go on that side. And I want that to go there, but it won't let me do it. Right, I'm trying to figure out how this is now going to even turn into here. It won't let me do it. I don't quite know how I meant to place down these these lines. Right, that connects into there. This won't... <laughs> Apparently, it's not suitable, is the answer. Apparently, it's not suitable. But from there, anyway, from the depot, I could... Wait, hold on. Hold on. What have I done? Cancel you. So, from the depot, I then... I want to go to here, but I've said I can't make the turn. Yikes. This is going to be an issue. This is going to be an issue. Oh, okay. We've managed to go on that side. So, still can't get over there. <laughs> uh, it's all fun and games when you're trying to build a tram line. It's all fun and games, guys. So, placing you back down to here. Let's try this again. So, I'm trying to make this turn to here. But it just, it just doesn't want to do it. It honestly doesn't want to do it. So I, d I don't know what to say about this. Well, I figured out how to connect anyway. So that's the main... Oh, wait, hold on. I haven't got to put... No, it's all, it's all fine. But then i got to try and flip it around on this section. So in reality, I should be able... Right. To place a turn. There to there. And then this would go there to there. So that turn there works. So there to there. And we're coming on the in inside one. There to there, that's fine. Oh, wait. Is it because it's a one-way system? Was that a one-way road? Where's it gone? Ah, it's a one-way road. I've just realized it's a one freaking way road. Right, so how would I upgrade the road to be the road I want without extending off it? Define, build, runway, avenue, pedestrian. I'm am I thinking too much into city skylines right now? Right, I don't want to build. Right, I've deleted the road. I've deleted the road. Deleted the road. But I figured it out is the main thing, okay? I figured it out. So let me pause the game. I'm having a right nightmare right now, aren't I, guys? I'm having a right nightmare. So delete the road. Then we place a road to connect there. Apparently not enough space to build here. Can I go for something a little bit smaller? An avenue? No. Is there like a smaller, just like a simple back and forth road? Oh, I think the issue is this. Right, delete you and you. 
Guys, I've, I've really, <laughs> really pushing boundary. I am literally rebuilding the city right now. Oh my goodness me. Right, get that depot back down. Right, I figured it out, okay? So, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Right, bam, bam. Bam, bam. So, okay, right. Back to business. There we go. So that's going to go this way up to then go round. That I can do that, but also go straight ahead. Right, that turns there. Bam, bam. There. Now, which side is this on? It's on the outer layer one, okay. Right, that into there. See, I've now, I've, now I understand. I figured it out. So obviously that would go into there. That comes out to there, but also allow it to go that way. Allow this to go this way. Allow that to go that way, but also allow that to turn into there. We got it. Freaking nailed it right now. Shut the front door. Your boy knows how to build trams. Right, there to there. There to there. Okay, so that goes around. Okay, apart from here. Right. Got it, mate. I got it right now. Shut the doors. Your boy's on fire. Right, so stop stem. I'm going to add in a few additional stops right now because I obviously have the ability to do so. Right, so we need to go to here. We need to this line here and we're going to bam new and we are going to select the depot which then comes out to here to the why can't it go to there? There is no route from the the previous one. Wait, what? Do you not see the route? Can I skip? I can skip that stop. Oh, is it because the road's wider? It might be because the road's slightly wider. Right. Get out of this. Yes. So I can make it do this. Ah, they're throwing a little curveball in for your boy, aren't they, guys? They're throwing a little curveball in. So we got to there. Right, add a new stop. No. Now what's happened? Right, cancel all this. We'll start again. Right, bam. Bam. Where's the line? Right, what's going on now? Get rid of stop two. Why is that highlighted? There we go. So, bam. Bam. Still nothing for the pre... Wait, have I fully got to go over, over, over? Oh, I might need to go over, 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 over. <laughs> Do I... I actually have to, yeah. Right, now I'm figuring out more issues. Right, please be patient with me. So we're going to have this problem with other... I think that's the only place I'm going to have the problem with. So now, finally, a gazillion years later... Right, but it's, it's good that we have these issues. Okay, we're having them there too. It's good that we have these issues because I now am able to overcome, improvise, and adapt. So there to there... Which means that goes there to there. I mean, it's very expensive for infrastructure-wise. Bam. Okay, can't do it here. So that goes around to there. Because we need to also pump it into there. Which then this bends around to here. So back on it, boys. Boom. See, I know how to do trams. You guys don't know what you're talking about right now. <laughs> right, no available route again. And I'm going to assume it's because... Yeah, 
We're gonna need to get these in. Alright, just merge it into there. It's nice and easy to do so. There we go. Bam. Now, I did one going the opposite way. I just realized this. I've just realized I've done it going the opposite way there. It was not needed. But there we go. We have a route. We actually have a route. So we now need to buy a vehicle for the route, don't we? In this depot, buy some trams. And because... I'm Well, you know, I did such a good job. <laughs> don't know what you're talking about right now. Um, how many do you want me to buy? Kick in the depot, set the transport panel, then buy enough vehicles to get your line going. Okay, so I'm gonna buy. I'm gonna buy five. There we go. It says buy three trams, but I bought five. Sometimes you need to take a loan to handle uh, upfront expenses to get your company going. Banks offer you loans, so you should check out the possibilities. Don't be afraid to take on loads, as they offer a great chance to build bigger. Try it out. Okay, so we need to get a loan. Uh, get rid of you. Right. Let me go back into play mode until my trams actually come out. And. How much of a loan do they want me to take? So I can take a 10,000 big one loan, pay it back in 10 weeks, the world's shortest loan, um, with an interest rate of 7.96%. That's not a very good um, rate, but I'll take the loan anyway because the tutorial demands me to. Uh, there's lots of information about uh, available which shows you how your company is doing. Have a look at the graphs panel. Okay, okay. Uh, here we go. Uh, this is your bottom. You can find many different graphs for your company. So, which one does it want me to check out then? So, in company popularity. Took a hit recently. <laughs> it took a hit. Um, okay, okay. We've got network coverage. We've started to increase the coverage right now in the last day uh, for peeps. Big shoot up for the blue collar, which is understandable because we set up this bus route, which is right outside one of their houses, which nobody really wants to use it. Hilarious. Uh, number of lines. Uh, hang on, open the company value graph. That's what they want me to do more than anything, don't they? The company value. Which one's that? Company value. Cash flow, tickets. Company value. And we are currently worth... We are decreasing in value. <laughs> uh, that's hilarious. Absolutely hilarious right now. Okay. So, pricing is also a great, uh, uh, of great importance. To pay your loans, you might need to adjust ticket prices. Also note that the economy situation is likely to change every once in a while. So keep an eye out for displeased passengers and adjust your prices accordingly. Just for now, you can lower them a bit. So, to lower them then, we can slightly adjust ticket prices. Let's say by 0.20 cents uh, for now. So by 20 cents, so uh, there we go. We've lowered the tram prices. Very good, sir. Very good. So you can now set customized ticket price zones. Just use the zone tool to paint the zones. Oh, okay. See your skylines. I see you. I see you. Uh, define zone. Uh, zone. The blue zone. Oh, we've seen this feature before, guys. I mean, technically it was in this game first. Uh, right, there we go. So, economy. I painted the zone, haven't I? Yeah. What, is, what does it want me to do now? Uh, paint the zones however you like. Uh, have four different uh, price zones. Okay. Apparently, I've got four different. I don't know what that means. Um, okay. You can also control the wages you play. You, you really. Can you? Oh my goodness me. So, give everyone a 20 uh, point increase. Okay, so. Everyone's got an increase, guys. Everyone's got an increase. I am such a good boss. Uh, every scenario has an objective, which you must meet to proceed with the campaign or finish the scenario. You can see the objectives by clicking on the objectives tab at the left edge of the screen. Uh, this tab shows you how close you are to your goal. Okay, so we need to build one metro line. Okay. Reward? 5,000 big ones in cash. Right, uh, okay, so build a metro. 
Seniac, <laughs> build a metro. So the metro structure's there. Here. Now, in reality, what's the best place to build the metro? I don't know. Uh, metro stop. How do I connect the metros up is the next question. Metro tracks. Now, metro... Is underground obviously just double checking because you never know <laughs> you never know uh, metro stop then so should I do like a little bit of a loop going around I don't know so metro stop metro stop we've got the waypoint we have the basic metro depot so let's build the basic metro depot to begin with um, okay let's just put that here for example okay we're just going to put it there. So then I need to build... Well, should I build the structures first? How come I can't place a structure down? Can I place it up at this location? Right, okay. We have the underground metro depot. So, right, okay. So let me build the metro track then. Wait, how did, wait, hold on. This metro is not underground, is it? No. It's not I'm not am I thinking subway? Is that what I'm thinking right now? I'm thinking of a subway, aren't I? Right, where am I going to build this? I don't really know where to build this. Um <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm a little bit confused. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie right now. I don't really know where to build this. So... Right, structures. Oh, large underground metro depot. That's what I want more... That's. I think that's what I want, isn't it? I'm building like an above ground one. Let me see if I can go. Large, okay, basic underground metro depot. That's what I want. That's what I want right now. Have I broke the road? I might have broken the road slightly here. Let me replace this road back. I actually don't know which road it was. Or what type of road is actually here. Right, there we go. They're, they're just getting that. So, yeah. Metro tracks. How does this work? So. Metro stop with ticket machine. Fine. Is there like an underground mode I go into? Oh, I think there is. Because you set the... I'm more confused than ever before. They haven't really given me the tutorial, the lowdown on how to build a metro, have they? They haven't, no. Um, I'm not sure how we build a metro. <laughs> um, okay, so. Shaving, uh, now it's time to complete the objective and finish the tutorial. So build one metro line. That is it. That is it. Now, obviously, I'm thinking I have to build an underground one. Now, technically, I don't need to build an underground metro. I don't need to build one at all. But at the same time, I can't place a stop down unless it's on the actual train track. That's how it obviously works. Now, my problem is, right, I want to be able to build an underground metro. And I don't seem to have the capability to do so because the train or the metro tracks, um, I don't know how you build them underground. So for the argument's sake, shall I just build a... Above ground one? 
But at the same time, right? At the same time, can you upgrade a road? No. At the same time, I don't know how I even begin building a metro. This game has not given your boy the logic, has it really? It's not really giving your boy the logic. Now, I could just build it for the argument's sake of building it. So, structures, uh, metro stop, bam, bam, but I've got to do a little bit of a U-turn. I haven't quite thought this one through. <laughs> right, I haven't quite thought this one through, guys, okay? But I've got a loop. I've got a loop I can build. Now, of course, we're going to need an above-ground station of some sort. I just realized this is on a cliff edge. What have I built? <laughs> what have I built? Oh, no. Right, can I go for a basic one? Oh, there we go. Basic one implemented. Very good, sir. Very good. So, I've just then... Do I need to get in the train tracks? I don't know if I need to get the train tracks all connected up. But, transport paddle. Depot 2. Can I... Uh, not depot 2. I need a new line, don't I? So, st the routes here. Create a new line for the metro. So, we're going to start, obviously, here. Can't come out to there. Now, that's got to be, be because... We don't fully connect... Does that delete everything? Oh my goodness me, that deletes everything. Alright, okay. We now know the game plan. We now know the game plan. Alright, could you start turning for me, please? All, right, all the way down. Will you not go in? Hmm. Right, don't judge. I can I can hear you judging right now. Just don't judge. Don't judge. And that completes the tutorial. Yay. Don't judge me, okay? I know that was bad. I know that was bad, but I just couldn't quite figure out what I was meant to do. Oh my goodness me. And that's the tutorial, guys. And here we are in our brand new city. Um, Guys, let me know if you want to see more of this as I try and build it all up. Let me know what you think about it in the comment section down below. But I've managed a tutorial. It wasn't the greatest, okay? But I definitely think we can improve. I definitely think we can improve right now. So until next time, I will see you all soon. <laughs> you want to see another episode? Smash that like button down below. And until next time, I'll see you all soon, guys. So <laughs>